less than 24 hours and you feel fully reset, fully recharged. And Should we go or no? I didn't even have a coffee today. Not yet. I've realized that I've never been on my own camping. And this weekend we had a great opportunity because Joanna is away and I had nothing planned. So I thought, I thought with Leila that we could go and do something. So uh, there we are in uh, Scottish borders. We're doing like a 30k loop. But the plan is to stop after like 15, 18k if we find, find a good spot and then we'll come there uh, for night. <laughs> I think I underestimated a bit the, the size of my backpack because well, I got quite a lot of things. I've got a lot of water, I've got some food for me and the dog and obviously things... Leila! Hey! Come on! So, yeah, it's, it's getting heavy. It looks like we arrived to Black House Forest. It's, we're gonna go through it and then around and back, but somewhere there along the line, we, along the uh, way, we'll come for tonight. Oh, it looks good. It's a dense forest. One more. Up, this way, up, jump. Yes, wait. Good job, good job, Leila. Gonna wait. There. <laughs> yeah. It looks like it used to be a forest here, and there's no more forest, but they growing another forest. It looks like Leila always know where to go, even though there's no route, because we ended up in the bog. Oh, I would like. I would love to camp now. I would have to build a little bit of a little shelter and go to sleep. Just it's too wet here. Look at this. Wow. So we had a great night's sleep. Well, a part of the woodpeckers, because it seems that Leila doesn't like them. Who knew? Uh, so we woke up a couple of times, but a part of that was nice, wasn't too cold, and now we are walking 
uh, towards the estate and towards our car. We've got like 10k, uh, so it's not gonna be that bad. So this is it. We almost done. Uh, as I thought, it's 10k from the place where we've been staying. So yesterday we had 16, 17, today 10. Not bad. Mm, one thing I've realized that when the dog pulls you, and the sheep pulls you, which is good sometimes, but it changes the way you walk, and it's a little bit harder on the places where normally don't are not sore. So mostly the the front of your legs for some reason. But apart of that, all good. So this Glen Estate looks like a really nice village. Actually, they've got like some kind of castle. This one and there's a lot of other buildings like this. And then there's a, uh, a place where regular fox live. And it was quite beautiful as well. Yes, so yesterday I was quite nervous actually because I've never done similar thing. I never went on my own to the hills. I never pitched a tent and I did it. And as, as always, things which are a little bit scary, one you, once you're doing them, they're not scary at all. I, I knew it's just, it's, it's just weird thing that uh, I don't know what I was expecting. It was just perfect. It was a perfect evening, uh, good night, perfect walk, everything played the way it should. A part of this when we get lost, but it's a part of adventure. Um, we are just back. It took us less than 24 hours to fully recharge. Um, well, I'm feeling amazing. I'm feeling tired, uh, but I'm feeling amazing. It must be all this fresh air. Uh, ah. It's quiet. <laughs> all right. That's it. Mm.